how do I fight sin? Yesterday we saw one way to do that is to see that sin really is bad. Today we'll talk about the opposite to see that the law really is good. And that's one of sin's tricks. It tries to convince you that following God's law is dumb, it's stupid, it's going to keep you from something you really want. Well, stop and see, is the law good? And you begin that by asking, is God good? See what he's already done for you. While you were still a sinner, Christ Jesus died for you. He loves you dearly. He is very good. And when he gives you a law, he's not doing it to grind you down, but because he knows what's best for you. Yesterday, we did an example of that talking about pornography. Let's just continue that theme. We saw that pornography really is bad. There's terrible effects there. Well, is the law good here? If I keep my eyes on only my spouse, will it help me? Yeah, it will. In fact, there's an entire book of the Bible about it, Song of Solomon, which just delights in the sexual love that takes place between a husband and a wife when they have eyes only for each other. And that is a blessing in marriage, and it helps you grow closer and closer together. So yes, the law is good. It helps you grow in your marriage even. That's a good thing. So whatever battle you're facing, ask, is the law good? And take some time to see what happens when the law is actually followed. Are there good results there? And you'll stop and you'll see that, yes, your God is very good.